Hey everyone, this is Matt, this is your new vlog, Nova 7. Hey everyone, thank you for watching as I record this. I am so excited because there is, let me check, how many days? 94 days until I go to Disney. Yay! All right. So what has been, what has happened since we last chatted a little bit? Well, here's what happened. Um, let's see. First, I picked my date. I am going on June seventh through January third. So I can't wait. It's gonna be so exciting. And I also got my roommate, and he seems really cool and really awesome. And let's see, my friend Alex. Got me the best, like, accepting presents, like, ever. He got me a Disney shirt. It's gonna be backwards, because I'm not flipping this video, but... Little Mickey Mouse says, Walt Disney World. I love it. And then... I got Pluto. I got Pluto. I love Pluto. He's so soft. Because now Mickey has his Pluto. And Mickey misses Pluto. Mm-hmm. Mm, I love them. Thank you so much, Alex, for all those. I love them. And I want to do something different in this video. So I went to Borders the other day, and I got the Wicked pop-up book, and it was really cheap. So I decided that I'm going to perform Wicked for you. Pop-up edition. Hope you enjoy. <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome to the Walt Disney Theater. It's tonight's performance by Matt Sitter Company. We would like to remind you that the taking of flash photographs is strictly forbidden. Also, please take a moment to silence all cell phones. And now, Matt Sitter Company proudly presents Wicked, the untold story of the Witches of Oz. Good news, she's dead, the witch of the west is dead, the wicked old witch there ever was, the enemy of all of us here in Oz is dead, good news, good news, look, it's Glenda. Hello, fellow Aussians. How are you all doing today? Well, I want to tell you a story. It's one about the Wicked Witch of the West. You see, she was not always evil. She was once, well, my friend. Now I know you won't believe me, but just listen to my story. And I'll tell you the story of the Wicked Witch of the West. Her mother drank some green elixir from a strange man, and then Elphaba turned out green. Now, that was only the beginning. You see, it all started, well, at school. Let's go there now, to Shiz University. You see, me and Elphaba were roommates, and, well, we both had some issues with each other, and, well, we decided to write letters to our parents. See, she had wonderful penmanship. She even used green ink. Oh, well, isn't that wonderful? Well, look at my stationery. Isn't it wonderful even more? Look at its pink. And come on. It's wonderful in pink. Like me. I'm Glenda Upland, you know, from the Upper Uplands. Come on, I had a lot to tell my parents. Look at my stationery. It looks like wallpaper, doesn't it? Isn't it beautiful? Look at it, little heart. <laughs> I was so young then. Oh, oh, over, please, over. Oh, oh, thank you. Oh, 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 look at that signature. Oh, over the rainbow, way up high. Oh, 
this is our bedroom as you can see I snuck under her pillow look what she had the green elixir all the time oh going through her stuff la 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 Oh, la, la. oh, what's what's in the desk? Oh, it's books and things. Oh, I decided to redo her. Look at look at that. Pink goes good with green. Oh, then I decided to invite her to a ball, and we became great friends. And then she decided to take me to the Emerald City. But before that happened, I changed my name to Glinda. But that's not really that important. We went to the Emerald City. We were going to go see the wizard because, well, Elphaba had some of these magical powers and I decided to go, well, tang along with the girl. I wore my nice yellow dress. I, I, it, it really went well with the city, I felt. I didn't want to be too green. Oh, you're probably not paying any attention to me. Well, here's the Emerald City. It's all emerald green and we wore these funny sunglasses. All the kids were doing it those days. Oh, then we went to, well, the wizard's castle. Then Elphaba had one of her little fits because she wanted to go save the animals. And so she, um, well, let's say, defied gravity. And everyone in the city was like, Oh no, she's wicked, get her! No, Elphaba, don't! And well, the rest is history. Ah! I'm not very good with the singing. Ah! That's how she did it when I was in there. I just wanted you to get the feeling of it. Oh, what's gonna happen next? Oh no! She was like, let these monkeys go! And the monkeys started flying around the room. I, I'm hearing the second hand from the wizard. See, he's in prison now. But all the monkeys were set free. Let these monkeys go, Elphaba said. Oh, wasn't that good of her? Oh, and then we've been changed for good. We became very close after that moment. And well, Elphaba melted. Oh, it's a very sad moment, but I know... Everything is good in your hearts now, and it's good in my heart, and I will be Glenda. The good. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching my video. I had fun making it. Hope you enjoyed Wicked Pop-Up Edition. This is like the only time I've ever been alone in my room for a while, so I decided to make a video now. Um, be sure to go on www.actor7690.com. I'll write it down there. Um, that's where I'll, I'll stop posting all my blog stuff, like even when I'm at Disney. And I'll start updating it with stuff, and it's going to be cool. I'll put photo albums there when I'm down at Disney. Um, be sure to follow my Twitter, at actor7690. Um, I don't really do anything with LiveJournal anymore. LiveJournal confuses me, so if I can just use that my website and just click on blog, there you go. You're all set. Um, nothing else I really to tell you. Thank you so much for watching. Soon to be Attractions cast member. you got to come down to Disney and see me and be like, hey, I know you. Alright, thank you so much for watching again, and have a magical day. Bye-bye now.